Hello, my name is Fat Talk, Talk 123 Game, and welcome back to Dicey Dungeons. We're on to the final fight of the main campaign. Hello, my doomed little Dysons. Oh no. Oh yes. Now, what are you doing backstage? Ready to give up on your dreams and go into minion training? We're leaving, you can't stop us. She totally can, sorry. <laughs> yeah, I definitely can. Haven't you been paying attention? We've been playing a lot of attention. We fought through your dungeons, we've beaten your bosses, and yet we're still trapped down here thanks to your rigged wheel of lies. <laughs> You're a cheat on and this game isn't fair, so we're going home. <laughs> uh, minions, the doors, enter lockdown! <laughs> There's a joke that I can make, but I won't. Once the doors are locked, that's it. We're stuck backstage until we give up. I'm really sorry, friends, but at least we tried. No, I'm not giving up. I'm not going to stay backstage forever. Quick, can anyone make it through the last door before it closes? And you get to pick your character. Whichever character you pick is what equipment you're going to get based on what their sort of style is. Personally, I like giving the Jester, because if anybody deserves to incite a rebellion against this bitch, it's the Jester. <laughs> yes, I can make it. It's my turn to play the hero. Come to get you, all of you, and the frog, and the baby squid, and everyone. I mean, I could leave the frog. We're gonna beat Lady Luck and we're gonna leave the dungeons. Just you wait and see. Rules. Find a way to rescue everyone and escape the dungeons. If Jess was knocked out, it's game over. So, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, every enemy you beat will join your cause to rebel against Lady Luck. You all share apples for health recovery, so you decide on who you think needs it the most. And yeah, get through to the end of this as many people as you can. <laughs> pew pew pew! I thought we were all trapped for eternity, but let's go! Let's do this! I'm ready! Fight, fight, fight! Right then. Two juggling balls and a wind up fist do five damage. <laughs> I do like the juggling balls, give me dice as well. And again, so what odds will uh, roll? I think it's four? Yeah, four even dies, which is quite generous, really. And I can't change my fighter at all because I am ZGS star. You don't level up either, if I remember, so um, don't rely on that for health recovery. That was a rough first round. Ooh, what a fight! I'm so fired up now, I want to come with you and fight some more. You are more than welcome. Probably going to use you as a bit of cannon fodder, but we'll see how it goes. You again, outrageous. That's a better than us. It takes time to still lounge around on level 1 fight and steal more dice when I'm more than ready to be a boss. This is the last rule. So, not beating you, I'm going straight to Lady Luck and put in a formal complaint. Just calm down there, Rosia. Just, just chill, mate. Uh, you know what? If I switch fire, I can finish this in one turn. So yeah, you've got to try and remember what each enemy has in terms of equipment as well if you want to get through this. Use your dice wisely. Look, I don't like you. I never will. The robot just got you. But if you're really going to take on Lady Luck, I'm going to come with you. Okay. Right then, there's another apple up there, so it makes sense to go for that next. Hi, baby squid. Yeah, not everybody will talk to you as you're going through the dungeons, but most of them will, to be fair. Uh, yeah, okay, that'd be perfect for the robot again, because that'd be a lot of damage. you really can be baby luck. I guess if you wouldn't you'll be leaving. I'll miss you. It's been so much fun having you around. Be okay if I join in on the rest of this episode? One last ride. Yeah, come on then. You'd be quite useful with the um, even dice rolls, to be fair. Should probably save that until I have to beat the pirate. 
just in case. That's gonna be a cannon fire? Six damage. Okay. So just in case he gets it again, which he has. Alright, apple will be for the jest of them. Uh baby squid, where are you? That's two sixes. And you could just tank one of the uh burns for me. Thank you. You win, the enemy joins your party. Thank you very much. Right, here what the Jess of Flags and get him killed. Otherwise it'd be all for naught. Ah, uh, we got the cactus coming up. <laughs> why? <laughs> Just why? Mm -hmm. Let's go with baby squid again. We roll two sixes. I kind of wish I could use the other two dice, but that's fine. Can't ever get a couple of twos, but... Ah, well. Fawns, too. Okay. Uh, let's have a look. Pirate, you could tank a couple of hits to be fair. Five damage, so that's not too bad. Plus one forms. Yeah, you'd be fine. Right. Um, baby squid, I feel like you deserve that apple because you did just get your ass absolutely handed to you. <laughs> All right then. Two sixes. Two sixes back. Why? Good grief, okay. Three and a six, okay, thank you. That's quite quite useful. Trying to think who I could use. We're gonna give me a five. Okay, yeah. So I could use pirate for that. Oh, to be fair, one place safe, just use a robot. Because I know that'd be free damage. Got the pirate's maximals for a second. Like, I know we're enemies, but otherwise, am I you're fighting? Can I ask a favour? If you're onto the snowman, can you give him a message for me? Oh, but you know what? Never mind. I'm coming with you. Yeah, why not? Just go! <laughs> I need more dice. What fun group you are, hiking through the dungeons like this. Here, I've got something for you. On the house. Thank you very much. You know what? I love it here in the dungeons, but if you don't, maybe you shouldn't actually have to stay here for all eternity. I hope you teach Lady Luck a lesson. Thank you. Appreciate it. It's a wicker man! I definitely wouldn't want a fireman against him, though. And I roll two sixes to start. Hell yeah. It's the amount of times I've just absolutely decimated this poor guy. <laughs> I don't think it's going to be any different at the end. Okay, I'm surprised you didn't go for um, the Wicker Staff then, honestly, mate. Thank you. Come join us. Breathe a little. <laughs> Let me get it straight. You try and leave the dungeons, you've got the minions to help you. You might want this. Thank you. Don't tell anyone I gave it to you without a trade. 
Alright, alright, your, your secret's safe from me. Chill. I'm not going to go run into Lady Luck or anything, to be honest. It'd <laughs> be nice to have a cowboy on, cowboy on our team, because he does a heck of a lot of damage. But i got to try and get past him without taking too much damage, so this might be where we start losing one or two characters. Uh, right. to worry about losing the robot. <sighs> robot was knocked out. Yes, he was. Alright, uh, seven fights remaining. Remaining? Just a... Uh... Ah, perfect. Cheers, mate. Uh, do -do -do -do. You can nine, do nine damage. Again, if I burn him, he only has 8 HP left. I better just hope he doesn't roll his 6 as his non burn dies. Yeah, okay, cool. Getting tactical. Nice. And then I believe it's Baby Squid again that needs health. Yeah, everyone else is relatively alright. Eight fighters remaining. Okay, we're doing alright at the moment. We do have a boss character coming up though. Audrey! Yeah, well, she'd be quite useful actually. <laughs> she could use Evens rather nicely too. Oh uh, boy. Because I want to keep the robot to the end. Not robot, cowboy. But he can tank it. First hit. And a heavy hit is going to be as well. Oof. It's not particularly friendly. Four, six. That'll be another set of sixes, right? Yeah. And I'll go on the run. Change character. Okay, maximum damage is 12. Wicker man, you got a bit of HP on you. If I happen to roll 6, it'd be marvellous. I want to leave a limit break when we face Audrey. Uh, 10 HP. Relatively low roll. It's yeah, better than nothing at the end of the day. If I could just get that to be cursed, yeah. That would be happy days. Wow, so many of you. All these bones all walking together around together in one place. Can I come? Yeah, sure. I know some we have flesh as well, but I'll look past it for the sake of the bones. Minor racism in the dungeons? <laughs> Uh, we won't go into it. Audrey, I'm coming for you. Uh, three and a four, guys. Yeah, against all odds as well. Uh, what can you do again? Six damage and headbutt. And it's glitched out, balls. Um. I gotta think about what's that It's not gonna let me select the other ones now, is it? No. Uh bloody hell. <laughs> okay, one headbutt. 
Okay, no, I just went straight for that. Okay, that's fine. Switch fighter. Thank you. Two for curse, isn't it? One for the money, two for the show. Right, and... I didn't roll me any sixes either, god damn it. Man, I can't curse her this turn. I hope it fires off. I don't mind on which one to be fair, as long as it you know, actually works. Why? <laughs> Why do you like this game? To sacrifice a rose. Ugh. See what happens. Okay, no damage this turn, thank you. I appreciate that. Needs to be even. Uh, yeah, go on then. How much health has Jessica got? 17, so he can theoretically survive. As long as she doesn't get two sixes plus enough for the earthquake. <laughs> That's cutting it very close. <laughs> Too close, but you know what? We survived! It's all good! <laughs> Welcome! Join my party! Jesus Christ, Audrey. Right, uh, definitely restore some HP to the Jester. Uh, who else do I want to restore health to? Probably the Cowboy, I would have thought. Because he can deal a ton of damage. Alright, you're done. Let's go for it. Like changes equipment every turn. <laughs> ah, I thought I'd tragic for eternity, but I see you've been running around the dungeons yet again. I've come to get my friends. And you've made some new ones? Yeah, well, I told them I was going to take you down. They're already keen to join in. Not super popular around here, you know. Oh, my dear. I don't need popularity. I have power. As you're about to find out. I won the vice versa fight. Check her equipment every turn. <laughs> you do not know what's coming. Do three times damage, fiery things only take one damage. Okay then. I'll be paying a visit to the uh, fireman then. Kinda wanna keep those evens for the fireman though, so I'll put that down to one and wind up first. Right, where are you? So yeah, for the first three attacks, it's kind of a puzzle game. See what the attack does. And then change accordingly. Lady Luck will always roll five sixes. Just be aware of that. Hat wearers and things that could float. Do I have anything that could float? Oh, I must do. Uh... Wearers hats and can float. Maybe Squid doesn't consider wearing a hat, surely. The baby Squid's the only person I have like boats. I guess technically the Jester floats, but I don't want to risk killing the Jester. I might have to make a sacrifice early on. Yeah, 
Yeah, I have a blind eyes. Not that, that means anything in this fight, but. Gonna die, aren't you? Yeah. Baby squid is knocked out. Yeah, you bitch. <laughs> Nine fighters remaining, though. Okay. What have you got coming next? Plants, green things, shield holders. Okay, cactus, you can survive as an next attack then. I have no evens, thanks for that. I got a lot of odds though. You only have 3 HP anyway, so you can die regardless, but. Get some use out of it. Okay. That's where I'm just doing 3 attacks anyway, but at least they do some damage back. Eight fighters remaining. Will Fortune issue command in so yeah. Okay, let's go with Jessalyn. I will say I absolutely love the music for this fight, like it ramps up like nothing else. It is amazing. Uh do 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 do. Okay, so next turn no damage. She's gonna start instealing some rules. Because she can. <laughs> You don't like my rules? Well, bad luck, because it's time for some more. More rules for everyone! Don't use ones, penalty finally looks to lose 5 HP, okay. Can't do anything with a cowboy in this turn anyway, so I'm gonna have to switch anyway. Do so much damage, if enemy HP is full, do double, gain a random blessing, so she can't kill anybody who's not saying I've got four. Oh, bloody hell, glitch there again. Uh, right. Don't use ones. Don't use ones. Okay. Lesson. Four shield, I like you need it, the health you got. Don't reduce any countdowns, penalty is lock two dice, okay. Uh, don't reduce countdowns, don't reduce countdowns. Watch the next attack. Do two times damage, shock all equipment. Okay, kill each other six, I've got twelve damage no matter what I do. Jesus. I did roll two sixes, however. That'd be useful for Audrey, actually. She's got plenty of HP at the moment. Okay. Don't use ones. Penalty for the point, lady. Like is end your turn immediately. Somebody's choosing violence. <sighs> Earthquake is a 10 reduce, right? Yeah. Um, okay. What are you doing in attack? Divine Dagger, 5 usage turn, 1 damage, that's gonna be 1, 3, 6, 10. That's gonna be 15 HP that I take off. Oh, God. Cowboy should be able to survive it just. If my calculation is correct, then it will. Yep, okay. We're all good. We're fine. <laughs> Don't reduce any of the countdowns. Penalty is finally heals 10 health, okay. Okay, Divine Sword coming again as well. That's going to be 6 damage unless HP is full. Jane person full HP is rose anyway. Don't reduce any countdowns. Uh, yeah, okay, skeleton be good for this one. If I'm lucky, he might even curse. fire the curse off on her. Okay. 
Ah, well. Are you about to go batshit crazy? Don't use sixes. Yeah, there we go. Reduce HP to one. Yeah, I'm just gonna pass the turn, actually. Might not even, <laughs> might not even fire off. <laughs> oh, look at that, you're still just about alive. I don't know how hard you were to get this far. It almost seems a shame to end it all. Oh wait, no it doesn't. In fact, it seems long overdue and very satisfying to me personally. Alright, last phase of this fight. She is pretty much going to kill a character every turn. She stops with all the rules, which is an upside, but she is going to kill someone every turn. So, um, yeah. <laughs> Shit. Uh, right then. Raise your evens. Uh, probably get a fair few attacks off of the pirate, actually. Ah, she used fours, not fives. Idiot. Never mind. Just roll with it. Just roll with it. Fifty HP left. Seven fighters remaining. We go next. Do thirty damage. Inflict ninety-nine curses. <laughs> Uh, okay. Where's the cowboy? I should have this in the bag, hopefully. Um, hmm. Could do 9 damage with him. It's 12 for your one, isn't it? I think I have the perfect amount of dice for. If I come in the next absolute zero, twenty five dash freeze all dies, okay. Switch fighter. The Rose could tank the next one. Don't like the Rose anyway. <laughs> and it cursed! <laughs> hmm. Alright, Jessa, bring it on home. Nice. Possible. Well, your dad's still with it. Mm. And amazing. You found us, and you you did it, and you bought the minions. You didn't give up. So happy to see you. Wait, confetti? What's happening? Why are those lights flashing? Because you won, you big silly billy. You refused to abandon your friends. Put aside your differences with the minions. And you gave up your worldly desires to be me. And you're... you're not angry? Oh my dear, no, of course not. You've done brilliantly. Gosh, when was the last time we had a real life victory? Just a darling, can you fetch the records? No, I'm not your minion anymore. And we don't have any records anyway. Oh, hmm. Are you sure? Tiny Pink Octopus, go see if you can find any records. Wait, it's so long for someone to actually win this game, you wouldn't believe. Well, it could have happened sooner if you hadn't made the game so hard and didn't cheat. And then um, what would you would have happened to your journey of self-realization? Now everyone pose for a photo. Beautiful. Such magnificent little bundle of fighters. Come on, one more. I want something to remember you by when you're gone. Well, when we got so we're all free to go? All of us? Of course. I don't get to be super strong? No. I don't get my followers? No, your prize is self-knowledge, darling. I thought we covered that. Also, I can't ever notice that I'm still a giant walking dice. Yes, and is there some sort of problem? Now, one big smile one more big smile, say cheese. 
Okay, look. I can deal with having to sleep. And I've kind of gotten to the use of the dice thing. What about the minions? Are they free to go as well? Yeah, we never made it out without them. Honestly, my loves, they're all very settled here. They might grumble a little, but they're families and vegetable gardens and everything. It's not the point. They fought with us. And they won. Yeah, I suppose you're right. They were very brave. I'll tell you what. They can leave if they really want to. And if they don't, then I'll see it if that employee suggestion box opens. It might increase everyone's holiday leave. What? Holiday leave? <laughs> from nothing, my dear. I'll increase it from nothing. My goodness, can't you just enjoy your confetti? <laughs> okay, I guess it's pretty good confetti. <laughs> Still, one last big smile and think about the lessons we learned. We fought so valiantly in these dungeons. In some cases, we fought side by side, and maybe in other cases, we fought in vicious opposition. But the important thing is that we did it together. Ah, my precious little dice kateers. My real life winners. It's such a delight having you here. Please, please do drop by any time. I absolutely promise I'll let you leave again. Now, did we ever make any end credits? You're just sore that you lost. <laughs> oh, man, but yeah, that's the end of Dicey Dungeons. On the main story, anyway. Somehow I done that fight on the first attempt. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the first time round it took me about 10. <laughs> and I think I still had about 7 characters alive. Can't remember the exact number, but yeah, that went so much more smoothly than I thought it would. I'm pretty sure when you done it, it took you, what, like 2 attempts? 2, 3? Yeah. You done better than what I did. True master over there, really. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man. Yeah, we're not done with Dicey Dungeons yet. Because we still got a couple of bonus episodes we gotta do, which we'll get into next time. I'll probably get a guide up for one on Halloween one, so I cannot be bothered to remember how to figure out the witches puzzle sort of fucking lies to me, honestly. <laughs> I've done it once, I don't mind using a guide for it. But we'll get to that when we get to it. Ah, uh, the fireman and the slow man managed to find each other and be friends, although wouldn't they? Cancel each other out. The snowman would melt, or the someone put the fireman. Anyway, I'm thinking too much into that. They're friends, that's what matters. I'm gonna be respectful of that person's name and not laugh at it. Um. <laughs> so. Oh man, so yeah, when we come back, we'll get into the bonus episodes, and we do also. Do I have any more challenges we need to fill out? To get ready for when we just go through. Okay, we've got a few. Oh, yeah, I've got to do the bonus round in hard mode. I think that'd be something that I record off screen and do a voiceover for. Because trying to do that during a live recording would just be hell. <laughs> so, like that, I'll just get you to do it. <laughs> See what happens. So, I can't believe you got through the witches one on the first try. <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> But yeah, so until next time, if you enjoyed your time, eh, please consider subscribing to the channel, be much appreciated. Whatever time is away, morning, evening, or afternoon, look after yourselves, and I'll see you next time.